James with Online Car Show, and I've got some really cool news from y'all from uh, Rev Automotive. So without hesitation, let's get this video started. Well, as y'all may or may not know, Rev Automotive is a new sponsor of mine. Uh, they've got really good products. I spent about a month reviewing them before I ever released any footage or any announcement about the new sponsorship. Uh, their products I found were actually surpassing a lot of the stuff I was using. And I get keep I get questions, you know, if I was to buy one thing or only, you know, afford a couple things from them, what would I go with? Uh, to answer that question, I think their number one thing I recommend trying that I'm just in love with is this Neo Armor. This right here is good stuff. Uh, I put it on after I wax or after I detail spray just as a protective layer over the paint or over the wax and it works awesome. It really brings out the shine as you can see in the video. I used it yesterday. Those that don't know, I drove up to uh, Camaro Fest which is in Bowling Green, Kentucky, uh, about a week ago. I did put Rev Automotive AU Cream Wax on the car, uh, and I followed up with a coat of their Neo Armor. And it was really easy to clean off once I was there to spray wash. I was amazed, and uh, when I got home, we drove through a rainstorm on the way back, and it was still fairly clean. So I was really impressed with the Neo Armor. If there's one product y'all go with from Rev to give them a try, I would say the Neo Armor. Uh, secondly would be their Serum X Detail Spray, which we're gonna get to in a second. Uh, other products I'm trying for them, uh, I'm trying their Wheel Brush. Uh, as y'all know, I've been testing different wheel brushes from different companies. I have found I like, so far I like actually the Chemical Guys wheel gerbil. This thing right here allows me to get in some of the hard to reach places on the wheels. Uh, you've got the Adams wheel brush, which is really nice, but, and I know a lot of people like the extra length of the handle, but honestly, I'm just not a fan. I am a fan of what it's made out of and everything else, but the length, it's just hard for me to get, I guess, leverage to clean and stuff like that with that brush. Uh, and here is the Rev Automotive, their cheaper brush on the channel. If you're looking for a cost-effective solution, I would say this one works pretty good. Allows you to get in some of the hard-to-reach places and uh, does the job. I am testing out their newer, softer brush and should have it soon. And as far as other products I've tested them that I've really liked, they have their Neo Glass, which has worked great. Uh, it's a streak-free streak window cleaner and polish. I uh, don't believe it has any uh, ammonia in it, so it is safe for window tint. Make sure you aren't using ammonia on anything that has window tint, like Windex or something like that. That will ruin your window tint fast. Also, their tire shine is freaking awesome. If there's a third product to recommend, I would get the Uber Shine. This has been far more superior than the other two brands that I've used. Uh, and it seems to work really good, holds up really good, and easy to clean off it, uh, when you wash your car. Uh, they've also got their breakaway wheel cleaner. Works good. This is more of a soap-based product. It's not going to turn red like some of the other brands. Uh, but it works good, gets the job done, cleans up the tires, the wheels nicely, and the tires. And I don't really use, I won the, or got this in a mystery box, I don't really use it much because I'm not a waterless wash kind of guy, but they also have their hydro wash, which works good, and I believe it's got kind of some detail or wax products in there, uh, give a nice shine afterward. So there's kind of where I'm at with their products. I am trying their Mr. Clean. It's in the mail on the way to me. So be sure to look out for a review on that product as well. 
And now for the big announcement, which is really cool. Uh, and they had a contest here recently where every dollar that you spent gave you an entry into their contest for uh, to get your picture of your car on their detail or their cleaning products, their car care products. Uh, so at the same time I was buying these products y'all see here, I was able to actually win, I was one of the 12 that won the contest and so I got my car on the front of a bottle which is really cool. And they and they put them on the Serum X bottle, the detail spray, which is awesome. So I'm not even going to use this bottle. Uh, I've ordered another bottle of Serum X, so I don't have to pop the top on this one. As you can see, it's their Serum X product. And when you turn it over here, get you a closer look. You see my car here on the side. It's got my Instagram at Online Car Show. Very freaking cool. Uh, these guys, you know, really out of the box thinkers with their mar marketing. They've got some really good products. Uh, if you've never tried Rev Automotive, I do recommend you give them a try. And especially go out and buy the Serum X so you get one with my car. Uh, I'd love to see some posts from people, you know, showing up, picking my car or whatnot. That would be freaking awesome. But uh, so. Please go out and help support Rev Automotive and my channel and uh, check out Serum X, their detail spray. You'll get the online car show Nadia 2018 Camaro SS 1LE on the side. Uh, thanks again Rev Automotive. This is really cool and I'm so happy I've won this. Uh, I'll, I'll keep this for a long time with my car on it. That's pretty cool. Uh, if you are looking for a discount code for Rev Automotive for their products, you can use OCS15 to save you 15%, and it also gives my channel a little credit. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie to you guys. Uh, so please help support me, help support Rev Automotive. Give their products a try, it's not gonna let you down. Rev-automotive.com. Rev you can also check them out at Rev Automotive on uh, Instagram. Thanks a lot for watching my videos, guys. We've got a mod coming up from Camaro Fest. I bought uh, its reflectors for the rear fascia that I'm going to be replacing to match my GM parts house tail lights and third brake light. Really cool, cheap mod you can throw on to make it more uniform if you've got the smoke tail lights. Uh, so be on the lookout for that video. And uh, we've got lots of car shows and so forth coming up here in the future. So be sure to you know check those videos out as well thank you so much for watching and y'all have a wonderful week there, didn't he? Yeah, he did. <laughs> That's better. That guy knows how to drive it right there.